Tilatoe Trace Trail. We are going about three miles out, three miles back. We ain't made it to the complete finish yet. We saw about 30 little waterfalls, and I've got them on here. Um, we are going to head out and back. It should take us about two hours, and uh, I'm going to have plenty of footage. Places we're at feel like we're in the jungle. Straight up the jungle. Look at this. Got a little trail right here going to this little waterfall. It is beautiful. I don't know if you can hear me or not, but here's what it looks like. That is about, I don't know if you can completely see, that right there is about a 30 foot drop. It is rolling. It came a big rain last night. It's a rolling. What do you think about it? It's a rolling. It came big rain last night, and it got all this water rolling. <laughs> it should be coming up on the waterfall any sick. I can smell it. Right. And right like a little flat up here. It looks like a big old rock cliff. 
So it should be here. I hear it. I hear it big time. Oh yeah, we're getting close now. Really close. See ya. Oh, she took off. Oh, it's getting real tight. We're getting real tight here now. Can you hear him? I hear it loud. So I don't know how good video I'm going to get. If you've been able to hear me, but I will video the waterfall for you. So it's really, really loud. This is the Shilatoe Trace Holiday. Day. Link in the description below to be able to see the video. It's really loud. It is getting rough. This is really rough here. I don't know how I'm going to get down here, so I'm going to turn you all off before I hurt myself. There's steps all the way up. This is really, really neat. You can see a whole lot here. And it has plenty, plenty of views of it. Just make sure you bring extra shoes and socks and clothes because it is extremely muddy. Really, really muddy. Slick and everything. It, there's waterfalls all the way up through here. And uh, it's well worth the hike. I'll leave the link in the description below so you can go take pictures. Go look at the pictures and uh, see if you want to try it. It is great. Well, we made it. Sitting here relaxing now. Going to quick out. Make sure when you do this, make sure you bring plenty of water and snacks because you never know how long you'll be out here. Look at our view here from the bench. It's, it's pretty neat. I should really get here and try this.
Shello Shell Toy Trace Trail number 100. This is the one we just done, and we drove, and this is the one where that dead coyote was at. And uh, we should. Well, we're thinking about doing this sometime and doing a two nighter where we'd have to stay in camp overnight. So uh, thank you all for watching this video, and uh, I'll have another one pretty soon. We'll do some, might do some more squirrel hunting, turkey hunting this spring, fishing pretty soon. Um, so I'll leave a link in the description about all this uh, trails we've been doing, and uh, we're going to do a lot more, and some bushcrafting while we're doing them, maybe some two nighters, uh, and uh, just keep on watching. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe down below and give this video a like.